Hello and welcome to my channel Networking with H. In this session, I will discuss about BGP local preference. As you know, BGP is the routing protocol for the internet. It is used to exchange routing information between different autonomous systems on the internet. I would say it is a protocol that helps network decide the best path for the traffic to travel between autonomous systems. So when you have multiple paths to reach particular destination, how does uh, BGP decide which path is the best? Like uh, from a AS point of view, if you have uh, multiple exit points uh, to reach particular destination, so how does BGP decide which path is the best path? BGP selects the best path actually to a particular destination using a series of attributes. These attributes act like decision criteria that influence the path selection process. Now in our scenario, uh, in AS65013, we have multiple exit points. So we have, uh, for example, to reach 10.1.1.30, there are two or more paths to that destination. So each attribute for each path is compared to determine which route is the best. The attribute that takes care of such scenario is local preference, often written as local pref. So let's go ahead and discuss about it. So BGP local preference, also known as local pref, is a well-known discretionary BGP attribute. It is used in multi-home networks to influence outbound routing decision within the autonomous system. If you see here the autonomous system 65013 uh, it has two exit points R1 and R2. The source in this AS uh, if it has to choose it will choose based on the local preference. So it helps decide which path the AS should use when there are multiple exit points to reach a particular destination. Local preference is uh, actually represented using 32-bit number and can range from 0 to 429, 4967, 295. It's a value. So the default value which is assigned to any route is 100. So if you have seen the BGP routing table uh, details and in that you will find a local preference value of 100. So local preference can be manually adjusted to prefer certain parts over the other uh, or you can keep it default if you want to keep it default if you want to change it increase it or decrease it you can do it. So the higher the local preference of a particular prefix the more preferred it is. So the funda is if you want to prefer some exit point or if you want to prefer some path, you have to make sure the local preference is higher. Local preference is propagated only within the local AS. It is not shared with external ASs. So it is uh, within the AS itself. If you want uh, a particular uh, path to be preferred, for example, in this case, R1 will advertise that path with local preference, uh, higher local preference than the default one or the higher preference than the local preference advertised by R2 within the AS like uh, R1 will advertise to R2 and R3 within the AS it will not advertise to the ISP1 or ISP2 so for uh, to understand how it works for example uh, here I have two ISPs right if you want traffic to exit through ISP1 by default so you can set the local preference of 200 on routes learned from ISP1. So if I am learning the route 10.1.1.1 slash 30 from ISP1, R1 will assign the local preference of 200. And uh, similarly, we can either keep the local preference uh, on R2 as 100 or we can change it to 150. So the higher 200 will make ISP1 the preferred path. That's how it works. So let's look at some of the use cases of uh, local preference. 
Local preference can be used for load balancing between multiple ISPs. For example, if I have uh, local preference a same, we can load balance it, right? Or uh, it can be used for traffic engineering to prefer one path for certain traffic and uh, another path for certain traffic to optimize cost or for performance consideration. Might be some traffic require certain ISP uh, and certain traffic requires certain ISP so you can use it for that as well also it is used for backup paths this is one of the important one uh, it is used for backup paths by lowering the local preference on the backup link so it is only used when the primary link is down this is used in most of the ISPs or uh, any big enterprises like if you have two links two exit points one will be used as a like if you have a higher bandwidth link towards ISP1 and a lower bandwidth link towards uh, ISP2 just to make sure when the primary link is not available the backup link can be used uh, so you can make it work by increasing the local preference towards uh, ISP1 because when the local preference is higher it will prefer ISP1 so when there is an issue with the link, if the link goes down, automatically the traffic will shift towards ISP2. That's it for this session. I hope this was informative for you. Thank you for watching. Please do like, share and subscribe.